That is. Thanks alone, I would die. Hopefully that may means of communicating. There's such an incredible species of ant. In our shared planetary home, humans coexist with an astounding variety of creatures, insects being a particularly prolific group. Current research estimates a staggering 200 million insects for each human on Earth, revealing the vast diversity within this intricate ecosystem. Naturally, this biodiversity includes species with the potential to pose threats to human well-being. From venomous stingers to insidious disease vectors, Join us as we show you the 30 most dangerous insects in the world. Number 30. Lanomia obliqua caterpillar The Lanomia obliqua caterpillar, also known as the assassin caterpillar, inhabits tropical forests from Mexico to southern Brazil. Contact with its bristly spines releases a deadly anticoagulant venom that prevents blood clotting and can cause fatal hemorrhaging. This caterpillar's soft, Touchable-looking bristles actually contain an anticoagulation toxin. Even brushing against the spines delivers the poison through the skin. Within minutes, severe pain and bleeding occur at the wound site as blood fluid leaks under vessels and fails to clot. Over the next few hours, blood continues seeping from the gums, eyes, and injection point as the toxin spreads systemically. Large blood blisters form under the skin. Without treatment, Eventual hemorrhaging of the kidneys, brain, and other organs leads to organ failure, seizures, coma, and death. There is no antidote to the venom, so hospital care focuses on replenishing clotting factors and performing transfusions to restore normal coagulation. Number 29. Tarantula Hawk The tarantula hawk is a large, solitary wasp in the southwestern United States that paralyzes tarantulas as living food hosts for its larvae. It delivers one of the most painfully intense stings of any insect. Reaching over two inches long, the female tarantula hawk hunts, stings, and paralyzes tarantulas as prey for its offspring. The adults drink nectar. Their dark blue-black bodies and bright, rusty orange wings serve as a warning of their extremely painful sting. According to entomologists, the tarantula hawk's sting is searingly excruciating described as blinding, fiercely electric, and shocking and totally debilitating. The venom overwhelms pain nerves, provoking minutes of agony, yet lethal toxicity to humans is low. Despite the sting's paralyzing pain, tarantula hawks are relatively docile and unaggressive towards humans. The agony seems to function more as anti-predator protection. Still, it's wise to avoid handling these insects and leave them undisturbed as they hunt. Number 28. Puss Caterpillar the puss caterpillar is the larva of a southern flannel moth found throughout the southern United States. Its fuzzy exterior conceals venomous spines that deliver an extremely painful sting upon contact. The fur serves as a warning signal. Underneath the hairy exterior are spines connected to toxin glands. The venom contains proteins and other chemicals that are highly irritating. When touched, the spines release the venom into the skin. Within minutes, the sting site erupts in intense throbbing and radiating pain with redness and swelling. Nausea, vomiting, swollen lymph nodes, and other symptoms have occurred in severe cases. The pain may last for several hours, but long-term effects are unlikely. Number 27. Black Widow Spider The Black Widow Spider is a highly venomous spider found across the United States and parts of Canada and South America. Females have a distinctive red hourglass marking on the underside. Their neurotoxic venom can cause severe muscle spasms, but is rarely lethal. This spider's venom contains latrotoxins that trigger massive neurotransmitter release and involuntary painful muscle contractions. Symptoms include sweating, hypertension, nausea, and abdominal pain that may radiate through the body. Without antivenom for serious envenomations, muscles remain rigidly contracted and breathing may become impaired due to paralyzed respiratory muscles, constituting a medical emergency requiring prompt, supportive treatments. Ounce for ounce, the neurotoxins are estimated to be 15 times more potent than rattlesnake venom. Number 26. Kissing Bugs Kissing bugs are blood-feeding insects found in parts of the Americas that get their nickname from their habit of biting humans around the mouth area while they sleep. Their bite spreads Chagas disease. 
There are over 130 species in the Reduviate family, but only some carry the Trypanosoma cruzi parasite that causes Chagas disease. This illness infects around 8 million people, mostly in Mexico and Central and South America. Some U.S. cases occur too. The parasite is passed in kissing bug feces. As the insect feeds, it defecates near the bite, allowing parasites to enter the wound and infect that individual. The disease often goes unnoticed initially but can cause life-threatening heart issues years later if untreated. Medications targeting the parasite may stop progression if given soon after infection, but no effective treatments exist once organ damage occurs. Reducing kissing bug populations is key for control. Their bites also provoke allergic reactions in some people. Number 25. Bullet Ant The bullet ant inhabits Central and South American rainforests and has one of the most painfully toxic stings among insects. The searing agony lasts 24 hours, giving rise to its Spanish name Hormiga 24, or 24-hour ant. This large ant's venom contains ponorotoxin and other neurotoxic peptides that overload pain receptors when injected through a sting, creating sensations of burning, blinding, and shock. The pain peaks within five minutes with waves of agonizing intensity that persist for a full day. On Schmidt's Insect Sting Pain Index, the bullet ant is ranked highest, described by the creator as pure, intense, brilliant pain, like walking over flaming charcoal with a three-inch nail in your heel. Few other insect stings rival the bullet ant's agonizing potency. Despite the temporary torture of its sting, death is unlikely but possible from toxic effects if swarmed with many stings. Some tribal initiation rituals involve intentional stinging by these ants to demonstrate courage and enter manhood. Fortunately, the misery is short-lived. Number 24. German Yellow Jacket The German Yellow Jacket is a wasp species common across the United States and Europe noted for its painful, venomous sting. Nests are built underground and fiercely defended if disturbed. This wasp has distinctive yellow and black banding. Its sting injects chemicals like acetylcholine, which provoke immediate intense pain and rapid swelling at the wound site. The acetylcholine also alerts other colony members to attack. Stings are extremely painful and described as a burning shooting sensation. Even one sting causes throbbing and radiating pain lasting up to an hour. Multiple stings increase toxicity, risking life-threatening anaphylaxis in those allergic or have circulatory collapse from venom overload. Despite their ability to deliver agonizing stings, German yellow jackets are not aggressive unless the nest area is disturbed. Number 23. Fire Ant The fire ant is an aggressive, stinging ant native to South America that has invaded the southern United States, Taiwan, Australia, and China. Their painful stings can cause severe allergic reactions in sensitive individuals. Fire ants swarm out of disturbed mounds in large numbers, repeatedly stinging the target and injecting venom with allergenic proteins. Around 5% of people develop systemic allergic reactions requiring emergency care to prevent anaphylactic shock and death. Those with known fire ant hypersensitivity should carry epinephrine auto-injectors and seek allergy testing and venom immunotherapy to reduce risks from stings. Avoiding mounds and nest areas prevents encounters. Their stings provoke burning pain and raise itchy welts. Number 22. Hymenoepimesis argyrophaga. Hymenoepimesis argyrophaga is a parasitic wasp species that inhabits Costa Rica and preys on spiders, paralyzing them with its venom and laying eggs for its larvae to consume the living host. The female wasp paralyzes the Plesiomata argyra spider with a sting and transports it back to her nest where she lays an egg on the abdomen. The larva hatches and feeds on the still-living but paralyzed spider, keeping it alive as long as possible to eat the entire body contents before pupating. The venom contains neurotoxins that block nerve signaling by inhibiting sodium channel function, causing full-body paralysis within seconds, but leaving the spider alive. The larva requires a live host to eat while developing, keeping the spider immobilized but alive for 10 to 12 days until it finishes consuming the body and emerges as an adult wasp. Number 21. Beetles. Beetles constitute a highly diverse order of insects with over 350,000 known species. Some can inflict painful bites, stings, or skin irritation. 
Blister beetles in particular can cause painful blistering rashes. Blister beetles contain cantharidin, a caustic chemical that fiercely irritates the skin and causes sizable flictinules or blisters. Some large tropical species also have strong mandibles that can crush soft human skin when handled. Their bites are extremely painful. The heavily armored Hercules beetle has mandibles powerful enough to give a painful nip with its vice-like grip. Other large beetles like Agasoma centaurus also produce pinch-like wounds when grasped. The Titan beetle's jaws can theoretically even pierce fingertips. Blister beetle poisonings are also concerning, as their body contents are toxic when ingested. Cantharidin causes burning, ulcers, bleeding, and kidney damage at high doses, sometimes fatally. Simply avoid handling unknown beetles to stay safe from bites and toxic effects. Number 20. Brown Recluse Spider The brown recluse spider is a venomous spider found across the southern United States from Kansas to Georgia. It gets its name from its coloration and tendency to reside in remote, undisturbed spaces. While not aggressively dangerous, its hemotoxic venom can cause severe skin lesions in some cases. These spiders have a dark brown body with a distinctive violin-shaped marking on the cephalothorax. Their eyes are arranged in three pairs, unlike most spiders. They build irregular webs in closets, basements, garages, wood piles, and sheds, anywhere dark and secluded. They hunt at night, preying on insects. The brown recluse's venom contains the enzyme sphingomyelinase D, which breaks down cell membranes. Most bites occur when the spider gets trapped against bare skin and reacts defensively. The bite is usually painless initially. Over the next eight hours, a painful white-ringed lesion develops at the bite surrounded by swollen redness. The area continues deteriorating, leaving an open necrotic ulcer that takes weeks or months to fully heal. Rare systemic effects like fever, rash, and organ damage may occur. Number 19. Bald-Faced Hornet The bald-faced hornet is a large, stinging wasp species found widely across North America and noted for its potent, painful sting and aggressive nest defense behaviors. Workers have yellow and black coloration with a mostly hairless, black face. Nests built of chewed wood fibers hang from trees, shrubs, and man-made structures, often 10 to 30 feet above ground, but occasionally lower. Colonies contain up to 700 workers by late summer and die out each winter except newly fertilized queens overwintering underground. Workers voraciously hunt insects, scavenge human foods, and drink flower nectar. Their sting injects venom containing acetylcholine and other chemicals provoking intense, fiery pain with rapid swelling and redness at the wound site. The acetylcholine also alerts and provokes other colony members to attack. Stings frequently target the head and face as bald-faced hornets aim for these areas when defending nests. Multiple stings can be life-threatening, and allergic individuals are at risk of severe anaphylactic reactions. Number 18. Giant Tree Weta The giant weta is the heaviest documented insect in the world, weighing over 2 ounces and reaching 4 inches long. It inhabits New Zealand forests. Females have elongated hind legs and massive heads and jaws delivering one of the most painful bites relative to the body size of any animal. These wingless giants look intimidating but are actually quite docile and slow-moving. They crawl along branches and logs, their mottled brown coloring camouflaging them against bark. Nocturnal predators emerge at night to feed on plant matter and carrion using their long antennae. Mating involves the much smaller male climbing onto the female's back to copulate. Their formidable mandibles generate bite forces up to 700 newtons, among the highest recorded for any insect proportional to their size. They can readily break human skin if handled carelessly. Bites leave deep, painful punctures that bleed freely and require weeks to heal. But the giant weta does not produce venom beyond the physical damage of the bite itself. Still, its crushing mandibular grip makes mishandling these giants ill-advised. Number 17. Botfly The botfly is a parasitic fly species with a nightmarish life cycle that involves injecting eggs into living mammal hosts, with the larvae burrowing into the skin to mature. Infestations cause painful skin lesions with the larva visibly pulsing inside. Adult female botflies capture mosquitoes and then lay eggs on their abdomens. When the mosquito bites a mammal, the eggs drop onto the skin and hatch. 
First stage larvae burrow into the host, creating a sore containing the actively growing maggot. An opening remains for air intake. The larva molts through three stages in six to ten weeks, nourished by the surrounding tissue fluids. Eventually, it emerges, drops to the soil, pupates, and becomes an adult fly. The larvae cause painful, swollen lesions with oozing discharge around their breathing holes. Improper larva removal can leave remnants under the skin, causing severe infection. Often the lesions are simply covered to suffocate the larva so it emerges intact when mature. Seek medical care for proper evaluation and extraction if concerned about potential bot fly infestation. Number 16. Velvet Ant. The velvet ant is a wingless wasp covered in red, yellow, or black hair that gives it a velvety look. The females pack a notoriously painful sting, earning them the nickname Cow Killer Ants. According to the myth, they could kill a cow. There are over 3,000 velvet ant species worldwide, mostly in warmer regions. They reach up to one inch long. Males have wings while females do not. After mating, Females seek out ground-nesting bee and wasp nests to lay their eggs in, where the larvae will consume the bee larvae as food once hatched. The female's extremely painful sting helps defend them against predators. It contains chemicals that provoke local swelling and pain that radiates up the limb, lasting up to 30 minutes. Those allergic can react more severely. Despite their appearance, velvet ants play an important predatory role in controlling bee and wasp populations. Number 15. Australian Funnel Web Spider The Australian Funnel Web Spider is considered the world's deadliest spider based on the extreme toxicity of its venom. However, the availability of anti-venom has reduced bites to being less of a threat than in the past. They are endemic to Eastern Australia. There are over 30 species divided into two groups, the Sydney Funnel Web Spiders and the Tree-Dwelling Funnel Webs. Both can reach two inches long. Sydney funnel webs are glossy black, while tree dwellers have more variable coloring. Their webs have a flat, funnel-shaped retreat area. Before anti-venom development in 1981, the Sydney funnel web was responsible for 13 attributed human deaths. Their venom can cause heart and lung complications that rapidly prove fatal without treatment. No deaths have occurred since the anti-venom became available in doses of up to 12 vials. Number 14. Housefly. While the housefly may not appear threatening, it is, in fact, responsible for numerous deaths every year. The common housefly can transmit dangerous diseases to humans and animals as it moves from filth to food sources. Contaminated feet pick up bacteria and viruses which transfer when they land. Flies regurgitate on foods as they eat, further spreading germs. Diseases carried include E. coli, salmonella, tuberculosis, cholera, typhoid fever, and dysentery, among others. Maggots hatching from eggs laid in decaying matter also spread bacteria. Proper food handling hygiene and safe disposal of waste reduce disease risks. While a nuisance, controlling fly populations, is important to limit the spread of pathogens. Screens, traps, and pesticides target flies in human environments. Number 13. Asian Giant Hornet The Asian Giant Hornet is the world's largest hornet at over 2 inches long. It inhabits parts of Asia. Its venomous sting can be lethal to those allergic and delivers intensely painful toxins. These aggressive predators attack beehives and other insects. They have fierce mandibles for capturing prey, which they dismember to feed their larvae. Their stinger injects neurotoxic venom that can cause kidney failure along with severe pain. Around 40 people die annually in Japan after being stung. Victims describe the sting as extremely painful, lasting days. Multiple stings can be fatal, Asian giant hornets vigorously defend nests, mobilizing to swarm and attack threats. A group can subdue animals and even humans through sheer numbers and repeated stinging. Number 12. European Dark Bee The European Dark Bee is a subspecies of the Western honeybee known for its predominantly dark coloration and aggressive, intense nest defense behaviors. They occur in parts of Europe and have been introduced in some areas outside their native range. Compared to the Italian honeybee varieties kept by many beekeepers, European dark bees have mostly dark gray or black abdomens and thoraxes with some lighter banding. Their stings contain the same venom compounds as other honeybees and are no more toxic. However, 
They exhibit more guarding behavior around nests and are incredibly persistent when attacking intruders near the hive. They vigorously bite, sting, and chase threats relentlessly to drive them away, eliciting painful stings to humans and animals. Those allergic to bee stings are at heightened risk around these creatures. Though not more venomous than other bees, their intense defensiveness and tendency to sting in swarms make them especially hazardous. It's wise to avoid interacting with or disturbing them. Number 11. Monarch Butterfly The monarch butterfly is known for its spectacular migrations in North America and distinct orange wings framed in black. But eating monarchs is toxic for predators due to poisons they assimilate from milkweed, their sole larval food plant. Monarch caterpillars feed exclusively on milkweed, which contains cardiac glycoside compounds. These toxins persist through metamorphosis into adult butterflies, making both caterpillars and adults poisonous. If ingested, the milkweed toxins can cause severe vomiting, diarrhea, irregular heartbeat in mammals, seizures, and death. The poisons deter predators, who learn to avoid eating monarchs after sampling their noxious taste. Humans should take care to avoid handling wild monarchs, especially their wings which shed microscopic scales. Number 10. Spanish Fly The Spanish fly beetle is found in parts of southern Europe and has been used historically as an alleged aphrodisiac. Still, its secretions are actually highly toxic and can cause disastrous side effects if ingested. Despite its reputation, the beetle's extracts offer no real benefits, only potentially deadly consequences. This species secretes the compound cantharidin, which was thought to stimulate amorous passions in ancient times. But in truth, cantharidin has no true aphrodisiac properties. It is simply a potent vesicant that burns and blisters mucous membranes, causing painful irritation, not enhanced libido. At the doses people assumed had stimulating effects, ingesting Spanish fly extracts leads to bloody vomiting and diarrhea, as the digestive tract is severely burned. The kidneys suffer damage as well, provoking painful urination and bloody urine as the toxin is filtered. Multi-organ failure, seizures, and death can occur from high exposure. One famous cautionary example is the death of King Ferdinand II of Spain in 1516 after consuming Spanish fly in hopes of enhancing his sexual stamina. The disastrous side effects quickly set in, emphasizing the insect's toxicity rather than its mythical benefits. There are many other accounts of illness and death from its historical misuse. Number 9. Red Imported Fire Ant The red imported fire ant is an invasive stinging ant species found in the southern United States, Australia, Taiwan, China, and other countries after accidentally being introduced from South America. Their venom can cause severe allergic reactions in sensitive individuals, this ant species has a painful sting it uses repeatedly to defend its nest. The venom contains allergenic proteins, including Sol-1-1, Sol-I-2, and Sol-I-3 that can trigger hypersensitivity reactions in people who have been sensitized through prior stings. About 5% of people develop severe IgE-mediated allergic responses to the venom proteins that require emergency medical intervention. Reactions progress rapidly from hives and swelling to full anaphylaxis with airway constriction, plummeting blood pressure, and loss of consciousness if untreated. Epinephrine, steroids, and other intensive care are required to manage fire ant sting anaphylaxis. Those with known hypersensitivity may carry epinephrine auto-injectors and should seek testing and desensitization therapy to reduce risk. Avoiding nests and mounds can help prevent stings that increase sensitization. Number 8. Maricopa Harvester Ant The Maricopa Harvester Ant inhabits arid regions of the southwestern United States. It is considered to possess the most toxic venom of any ant species, based on toxicity studies injecting the venom into mice and rats. The sting causes severe localized pain. This ant's venom contains potent alkaloid toxins such as macrocyclic lactones and a unique peptide called ponorotoxin, which have potent effects on sodium channels that mediate nerve signaling. The toxins disrupt normal nerve function to induce pain. Based on LD50 assays, the Maricopa harvester ant is the most venomous ant species tested. The ants can also sting repeatedly when threatened, injecting a greater total venom dose. 
The stings produce immediate intense pain at the wound site, along with inflammation and swelling. Beyond just localized effects, the venom can produce toxic effects on the nervous system, circulatory system, and digestive tract depending on the dose. However, lethal outcomes in humans appear very rare, likely because the small ants inject only tiny venom quantities. Number 7. Giant Silkworm Moth Caterpillar The giant silkworm moth caterpillar inhabits forests across parts of Central and South America and is considered the most venomous caterpillar species in the world. Contact with its bristly hairs releases a deadly toxin that can kill through internal bleeding. This caterpillar's body is covered in tiny hair-like setae that are connected to venom glands below the skin surface. When disturbed, the setae dislodge and penetrate the victim's skin, injecting the poison into tissues and blood. The venom contains potent hemorrhagic molecules that disrupt blood clotting and destroy red blood cells. Small hemorrhages start under the skin at the contact site. Over subsequent hours, bleeding grows more severe throughout the body as blood fails to clot and coagulate properly. Kidney failure, seizures, stroke, and extensive internal blood loss can lead to death in 30 to 40% of untreated human cases. Those who survive may suffer significant organ damage. There is currently no antivenom, so only supportive care and blood transfusions are available. This species goes by many names including the assassin caterpillar for its lethal venom. Number 6. Fleas Fleas are tiny, flightless insects that live as external parasites feeding on the blood of mammals and birds. They transmit diseases and can cause anemia or even death when infestations are severe, making them more threatening than their small size suggests. Fleas use their piercing mouth parts to bite and feed on blood for nutrition and to facilitate breeding. A single flea bite is itchy but benign, however heavy or prolonged infestations can lead to significant blood loss. Young or small animals like puppies and kittens are especially vulnerable. Fleas transmit bacterial diseases to humans including plague and murine typhus via infected flea feces entering the bite wound. Plague outbreaks triggered by infected rat flea bites killed millions in medieval times. Murine typhus casos still occur but are treatable with antibiotics now. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. By now, you probably have a good idea that insects can be quite dangerous. But imagine if an insect could burrow through human skin and get inside the body. What if there were wasps the size of an adult's hand? That would surely be terrifying. Consider the tarantula hawk wasp and the giant Asian hornet, for example. As the largest wasp and hornet in the world, the tarantula hawk can reach a length of 2.7 inches with a wingspan of 4.5 inches. The Asian giant can reach around 2.2 inches. Their large black bodies and rusty wings make them hard to miss. What's the most dangerous insect you've seen with your own eyes? Let us know in the comments below. Number 5. Assassin Caterpillar The Assassin Caterpillar is a highly venomous caterpillar species found in the tropical forests of South America. Contact with its bristles releases toxins into tissue that destroy blood cells and cause extensive, sometimes fatal, internal bleeding in humans. This caterpillar's spiny hairs connect to glands that produce potent hemorrhagic molecules affecting blood clotting and red blood cells. When disturbed, the bristly spines easily penetrate the skin to deliver the venom. Initially, a sharp pain develops at the contact site as the toxin diffuses in. Over subsequent hours, extensive bleeding under the skin occurs as capillaries leak. Blood pools and seeps from the gums, eyes, and injection site without clotting. Kidney function deterioration, organ damage, intracranial hemorrhage, coma, and death can result if not treated quickly with blood transfusions and supportive care. No antivenom exists. With its lethal venom, locals call this species the assassin caterpillar. Number 4. Killer Bees Killer bees, also called Africanized bees, are hybrids of African and European honeybees that are far more aggressive in defending hives than European varieties. They have spread through the Americas and have killed over 1,000 people with their venomous stings. These bees were accidentally created by a Brazilian researcher in the 1950s who crossbred an African subspecies with local European bees seeking to increase honey production. Some escaped swarms colonized the wild and interbred with European bees. The resulting hybrids exhibit the extremely defensive traits of African honeybees. 
They vigorously attack when nests are disturbed, chasing threats for up to a quarter mile from the hive while stinging relentlessly. A killer bee can sting repeatedly thanks to its barbed stinger that stays embedded. Their venom packs an extra punch too, delivering more melatonin and other peptides that enhance toxicity compared to European bee venom. Number 3. Siafu Ants Siafu, also called driver or army ants, are nomadic ants native to Africa and Asia that travel in massive swarms up to 20 million strong, attacking any animals in their path. Tales exist of them killing people unable to escape these marching hordes. Unlike ants with stationary colonies, Siafu form temporary bivouacs that move continually in search of prey. The blind workers attack en masse, their huge mandibles inflicting blisteringly painful bites while other ants spray formic acid. Stories from past centuries tell of Siafu swarms killing small animals and even human infants or disabled people unable to escape the relentless onslaught. Adults can typically flee to safety when attacked, but the elderly or disabled are also at risk. These migratory swarms consume almost anything organic in their path, from insects to earthworms. They help control pests like cockroaches that damage crops. But Siafu themselves can damage plantation trees by defoliating them while harvesting sap. Number 2. Setsi Flies Setsi flies are large biting flies endemic to sub-Saharan Africa that transmit a parasitic infection called sleeping sickness, which is often fatal if untreated. Disease transmission via setsi flies has killed millions in African history. Setsi flies carry the Trypanosoma brucei parasite in their saliva and infect humans through bites, typically on the legs or trunk. The parasite then grows and replicates within the body, eventually crossing the blood-brain barrier to infect the central nervous system if untreated. Symptoms begin as fever, headache, and joint pains like influenza. Untreated, the disease progresses to neurological disruption, personality changes, confusion, poor coordination, numbness, and disrupted sleep cycles. Coma and death ultimately occur as the parasites overwhelm the brain, with an estimated 20,000 deaths annually across Africa. Better diagnostics and treatments have reduced mortality, but costs limit access for many patients. Number 1. Mosquitoes Mosquitoes are ubiquitous biting flies and the deadliest animal worldwide due to their ability to transmit devastating diseases like malaria, dengue, and Zika virus. Mosquito spread disease likely kills over 700,000 people every year. Only female mosquitoes bite, requiring blood to develop eggs. In the process, infected mosquitoes inject parasites and viruses like malaria, dengue, yellow fever, and Zika into the human bloodstream via saliva. Malaria alone kills over 400,000 annually, mostly in Africa. Severe dengue epidemics threaten Asia. Zika caused a wave of birth defects in Brazil. And the list goes on, with new viruses constantly emerging like West Nile and Chikungunya to join the deadly mix. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.